Things are popping, pop, a Philadelphia way. We're gonna drop it, drop on all the music they play on the bandstand. Bandstand. How do you do, sir? And your name? Tony Russell. <laughs> and your age? No, 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 no. Please introduce me to your friends because I got a lot I want to talk to you about. Let's start. To, let's start right here since he's close and easy. The gentleman with the saxophone. I'm sorry. Am I confusing you? We we have an unbreakable pattern. We go to the man on the end, and if I change the rules, <laughs> that is my main man. Oh, that's Joe Martin. Hello, Joe. Nice to have you with us. Uh, let's jump to the man immediately next. The redheaded gentleman. Oh, the redheaded guy. That's Rusty Cloud. Rusty Cloud. There you. Go. That's uh, Daddy G. Well, not Daddy G. This is uh, <laughs> Joey Stan. Joey, nice to have you with us. Immediately behind us, Mac McCarry. <laughs> nice to have you, sir. On base. That is George Ruiz. George, welcome. And lastly, Billy Derby. There you go. All right. When I said I'd known you a long time, I don't want to embarrass you, but I remember your good, good times, bad times, in between times. You've had a lot of good things happen in your life. How old were you when you first had a lot of money and made a big hit? Uh, four. <laughs> I was about 19. All right, then, then along came the English and they wiped out all of the American they musicians. They sure did. What'd you do in the meantime when things went Well, we tried to uh, survive uh, through the Beatle invasion and through the chipmunk invasion. You know, they're back again. <laughs> yes, they're back to get you again. <laughs> but Gary does a thing in, in his act about the Beatles came over and chipmunks put him out of business. Insects <laughs> did him in. It wasn't music, it was insects. You were playing during one of those periods in a, in a small place. What was it? Describe the joint. Oh, it's a little, uh, uh, stupid little place over there in Jerby with it. Don't name it. We all may have to work there again someday. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was a little, little club over in Jersey and uh, had a big, Pillow on the top, or airplane, or something dumb like that, you know. It's one of many one-nighters yeah. and what have you. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Right, along comes a guy, walks in, and and the word there's a you know sort of murmur in the crowd. Did you mm. have any idea who this man was? I had no idea who he was or what it was. I thought it was a sandwich. Hey, there's a Springsteen sandwich here somewhere. I mean, Bruce Springsteen came in to see you because he had watched you all of his life, enjoyed you, listened, and all of that. But you you were unaware of it. No, you know I was listening to Oogie Boogie Woogie and all those <laughs> songs like that. Didn't didn't hear of him or his songs. Did he play with you that night? Yeah, he played that night. We, he came in and uh, finally introduced him. You know, and uh, you know they said you got to get this guy on whoever he is. You know, let him. In. So, ladies and gentlemen, here he is, Bruce Springsteen. The place went. Ugh. And he came you were impressed. The, oh, yeah, well, naturally, everybody rushed the stage. Well, I thought it was me. Everybody. <laughs> <laughs> everybody knows the rest of the story. He put his hand on your shoulder and got you off and going again. Not that you had hurt in the meantime. I always make the point. Everybody says, uh, "Gee, those guys who made the records in the '60s are they still around?" They're around. They make good livings. They're healthy, happy. But I mean, you're on the top of the charts. Isn't that great? Yeah, that's nice. Yeah, I like it, man. Did he produce this album? Yep. Yep. Him and uh, Miami Steve. Miami Steve yeah. Van Zandt. That's it. That's it. Uh, who wrote that first song, the one you just did? That was Bruce Springsteen. Who wrote the next song? Uh, Bruce Springsteen. If he, <laughs> if he calls you one of these days and said, I'd like to have you work on one of my sessions, would you answer that call? Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right away. <laughs> I'm so happy for you. Congratulations. Thank you very Continued much. Continued good success. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, one more time, Mr. Gary U.S. Bond. 